Baron Battles here, and welcome to our new YouTube channel. Now that's the Baron, so we've got a selection for Saturday, the Newberry Hennessy Gold Cup. And we're going to put this out early. And when I've looked at this race, I've had to look past Conor Gray and Sapphire De Ray. And the reason why I've looked past them is it's not because I think that they're not the best horses in the race. Because if it come up good, good to soft ground, you couldn't look past them two. So it's going to rain all week. It's going to lever it down all week. And by the time we get to Newbury on Saturday, and after there's been a lot of racing at Newbury, three o'clock, that course is going to be like a bog. And it's going to take some getting home. So what we've done is we've tried to pick an arse or select something what's got a bit of a lower weight but we'll know like the conditions and we'll stay the distance so our selection is going to be an each way selection and it's going to be Alan King's Smad Place and what we're hoping to happen here is like the two main principles hopefully find that out with Smad Place there and thereabouts and hopefully due to loving the ground and having less weight being able to do them I can't see this horse, Smad Place, finishing out of the, the first four. So that's why we're doing it each way in that 9 to 1 with 888 Sports, and that's best at present. I think it's, it's not a bad selection. Also, I try and get this 9 to 1 in the next couple of days because there's going to be some numb runners, and obviously the price will go. So that's why we've done it early as well. So that's the selection, Smad Place at 9 to 1 each way for Saturdays. Hennessy Gold Cup. We will be putting out some other videos this week, other uploads, because I, I really fancy one in the Sefton next week, so I might tie that up with something in the Fighting Fifth Hurdle at Newcastle on Saturday. So watch out for that upload. Also, I just want quickly want to put something out there about Connie Gray and the Bradstocks. It, I think it's a bit odd, me that it doesn't enter the better fair chase because it's spread a play and it's limping one week and then the week next the Bradstocks are coming out saying it's fit as a fiddle it'll be jumping with Nick on its back over a few few fences and it'll be ready for the NSA. I mean if I was the owner I'd be pretty peeved to be honest with you to miss out on the million pound bonus because let's face it if Connie Green would have turned up and, and, and that bet fair chase at ADOC it would have annihilated that field so it's natural route will be now Kenton and the Gold Cup and if it goes and wins them it would have missed out on the bonus one. I just think the owners have just been short changed but that's my opinion on things. I don't think it'll win the Gold Cup anyway so that's another thing it's sling out there. Anyway, good luck with all your selections. Cheers for listening. The Baron.